What an azipod is, is a 250 ton pod that hangs down from the stern of the ship. There is a huge motor in there that drives a huge propeller. Azipod motors actually turn so that you can steer by turning this huge 20 megawatt pod and you can push the ship sideways, you can push it any direction you want. These large ships, so we are using Azipods, uh, which is a electric pod propulsion unit, which basically rotates uh, 360 degree. Because they can rotate, they provide the very easy and accurate way of maneuvering the ship in the ports. There's actually a dial up on the bridge that the captain can turn the dial to the direction he wants those azipods to push. And that's what happens. We also have powerful bow thrusters up forward so that when the ship needs to maneuver in port or alongside or anything else, you can actually turn that ship literally, maybe not on a dime, but a quarter, a euro. Each pod is 20 megawatts. That's a whole heck of a lot of power. That's more power than a medium-sized city has. We have had a long relationship with ABB, more than a decade, been using Azipods. I think that they have constantly been evolving from efficiency point of view, from the design point of view. They are manufactured in Helsinki, Finland. Before the actual propellers are mounted on, on the Azipods, the ship has what's called zero thrust propellers, which basically when they spin, they don't create any thrust and then that allows the shipyard to test the azipods and the engines uh, while the ship is still inside the hull. Then they go ahead and they put on the actual propellers on the azipods. And when you're talking about ships as big as Allure and Oasis of the Seas, the only way you can really have a cruise ship that big is by having these huge azipods that are just fantastic engineering marvels.